Hi, and thanks for joining me for another video on growing spiritually. It's a vital part of the mission here at Mount Tabor. We have been studying over the last several weeks the story of David and Goliath. Our pastors have been preaching about it on Sunday mornings. If you've missed any of those sermons, I encourage you to go back and find those on our Facebook page, our YouTube page, or on our website so that you can follow along. We've learned a lot from David over the last several weeks. We have learned to call out our giants, to define what it is we're up against. We've learned to tune out the noise, those external voices or those internal voices that may say that we are not enough, to tune into the voice of God that says God is enough. We have learned to lean on our own experience of who God is and how he has been faithful to us in the past, past and how that will see us through this current situation. And we've learned about being confident in our own skin, knowing that we don't have to pretend to be someone else, that God has called us to whatever it is that we're facing and that God will be with us and equip us to face it. And so now here we are at the battle line. We're in 1 Samuel chapter 17 verses 40 to 50. David and Goliath are now squaring off against each other. And Goliath is surprised by what he sees. Goliath has expected a big strong warrior who's well equipped with lots of armor and weapons and he finds a young man with basically what looks to him like a stick. And he's surprised. And David says, you can come at me with all the things you want, all those weapons, all those shields, but I come at you in the name of the Lord God Almighty. And what David is saying is, I'm ready for this battle because God has prepared me for this battle and God is with me in this battle. And the lesson for us is that the world may try to define what it is that we need to succeed. And that may look very different from what God says we need to succeed. You see, Goliath saw David as very ill-equipped, but in reality, um, David was very well-equipped. A person in that time who was skilled with a sling and a stone actually carried in their hand a very accurate and deadly weapon. So while David wanted to set the terms of the fight, his, while Goliath wanted to set the terms of the fight in his way, David knew that God had set the terms God's way. And so David was able to do what now we should be equipped to do, which was in verse 48, it says, David ran quickly to the battle line to face this giant. And so we can do that too, with the confidence of knowing that God is with us, God has equipped us, and God will see us through to victory, that we have the exact tools that we need to face this giant, and God will be with, with us and see us through. So I pray that that brings you confidence this week as you face whatever it is you're facing. I pray that the Lord would surprise you with his kindness, that he would overwhelm you with his goodness as he is so faithful to do.